Hi guys, I wanted to um, show you what I do when I want to exchange my purse for another one and I usually do this about once a month. Um, the reason I do this is because either the weather's changing or the season or just the fact that I don't want, I'm noticing that it's getting a little bit worn with the current bag that I'm using. This one I just got it a few months ago, but I, I've been using this one since, I want to say November. November, no, no, December, early part of December. Um, only because it's been raining, and this is, I love this this bag. Um, forgot what's the um, the name of it. Once I, once I upload this, I'm going to Google it up and then um, write down the description. But I absolutely love this one. This is one of my favorites because during... The rainy weather, which is December, January, um, around Southern California, it kind of rains a lot. So this is, I noticed that this is waterproof. So it's been raining quite a few bit during the month of January. And everything I have in the bag has, um, has stayed dried. And I'm happy with, with the purchase of this. And I wanted to make sure that, you know, it stays clean and it stays looking brand new and that's why I often swap it. So I will show you guys the process that I do when I replace my bag. So first thing is I take out everything on my current bag, open up all the zippers, making sure that it's empty. This is a, um, it's actually used for a diaper bag, but I love the size of it because when I go and do my photo shoots, I just put in my large camera in here and I'm good to go. And it has a lot of pockets for like lenses and stuff when I do my, my shoot. So I prefer big bags over the small ones. And making sure that, you know, you go through all the little pockets because it does have a zillion pockets for the fact that it's supposed to be a diaper bag. And make sure that it's empty, which it is, you know, the big ones too on the sides. And then what I will do is I will get we always have baby wipes around the house. When you have kids, you always have baby wipes. So I'll get a baby wipe, but they tend to be kind of super moist. So what I will do is I'll just wring it out. It's kind of dry. And then I will start off with the inside, wipe out all the inside, even the pockets and do all that within all the pockets, all the little divisions, and then do that for the inside as well, and I'll usually turn it upside down and shake it. And then I'll also wipe around the outside, and especially um, at the bottom, because it does get um, pretty worn out at the bottom, so make sure you guys clean the bottom. And this is how I make it really look like I've just had it. This bag I've had, gosh, um, 2008 maybe 2007 right around there but I do take care of my bags so as you can tell it looks like I just got it and inside you know it's pretty clean from the last time um, I used it but I will wipe this down as well as this down before I put in my new stuff and then I'll come back and show you guys all right maybe I should bend down but um First, I'll put the big ones, big size, which is my final fix. I'll put this in here. The good thing about this is that it doesn't have a divider, divider in the middle. And then I have children's shot records. I always carry that in whatever bag I've got. And my library cards for me and the family. That always goes there because we go there at least once every two weeks, maybe twice. At least once a week we go there. And that one will go there. And this one, I actually have a little little coach, um, little pocket purse for all my little cards, like Barnes & Noble, medical cards, and all that stuff. But I think, I don't know where I have it. So, But for now, it's just going to go in here so it's out of sight. And zip that up. I have some business cards and 
old business cards, but these are my business cards. So put that into one of the pockets. It's usually the cell phone pocket that I put it in. Have my cell phone, put that in one of the pockets as well. And I have pens and one Sharpie. And I'll put that in there. My wallet. Put that in there. Makeup bag. This is my the sports sack makeup bag. And I'll put that in here. My keys will go into this slot right here. Always has a little hook. This is um this I love this keychain. This is from Coach. Got this at the outlet. I need to replace it. It's so worn, but I love it because you can use the hook and I can always find my keys. Mints are always nice. So the good thing about this one is that it does have a pocket in here. So I'll put my mint in there. This one, because taking some science labs at school, always could use some of these pocket back antibacterial. These comes in handy. And I'll just put that into the little pocket inside. This one is supposed to be a pill case. So I use this. This is for that um, herbal, herbal weight loss pill that I showed you guys that I'm taking. So I have one in there. I have, um, I have another container. Then I use that for my like B12. And then I have another one and I use that for another another one of the herbal medicine. And this is, I only carry this in here because of the fact that like I told you guys, it says to take it an hour before the meal. So like after, usually after school, I get out at 9.30, I'll take one because by the time I come home at 10 o'clock, I know I'm hungry and I'll eat. But I'll remind myself to take one at 9.30 um, on my way home from school and then have a little light dinner when I get home. So I have that in here. And this one are samples from Sephora. This is the Burberry Brit Sheer. This one is the Burberry Brit. And I like to put this in here because it's, it's very lightweight. Just, you know, one of those days where I need to smell, you know, freshen up. And I don't want to carry those big Bath and Body Works or Victoria's Secret body spray. This one just will go in the zipper. And then, oh, also this for school. Could always use a memory stick for school. And that's about it. See? Let me try to, whoop. Sorry, let me try to show you guys. There's plenty of room if you guys open it up. Just my Philo facts, everything's here as far as my schedules and stuff for school, for home, for business. My little makeup bag, my wallet. I have it upright just so that it doesn't take up so much space. And there's my little pill box. Then everything else I have, I put in the little zipper, my phone. And then actually sometimes I do put my phone out, out here because it's easier. And I think I will do that now because it's more easier when it's ringing. I don't want to have to search, even though I know where it's at. Sometimes, you know, you're in a hurry to pick it up and you're like, oh, I can't reach it, I can't reach it. But at least over here, it's there by itself. I don't want to put anything else in here but the phone. So I'll do that and that's it. See? That's it. See, that's, that's my purse. Thanks for watching guys. Bye-bye.